Alright, the latest ASIC shoes have dropped and here's what's caught your podiatrist's attention this year. The new Nimbus 26 looks to continue the great form that ASICs came back to with the 25. Lots of colours, soft supportive foam, a variety of fits is available and always one to consider if you're using an orthotic. But I have my eye on that weight though. After years of heavy bloated shoes, ASICs came back to their performance roots with the 25 and the 26 is just starting to creep in weight again. On weight, actually, the flagship running shoe from ASICS, the Kayano, continues to be as heavy as a ship. It's a big one. For years, your podiatrists have preferred the stability and performance of the lighter weight GT2000, and Model 12 continues that trend. So Kayano wearers, save your dollars, save your feet. You might run further and faster in the 2000s for this time around. And lastly, yes, give me more of the Tribuco Max 3. This trail shoe is an absolute stunner. I'm thinking we're going to see more of these and less Salomon on the shoes of fashion forward north siders in the coming months. But podiatrically, this big toe spring or four foot rocket is really interesting. While it might compromise a little bit of grip, it is going to be great for people who suffer with four foot issues. Bursitis, neuroma, bunions, things like that. Well done, ASICS. So that's what's caught your podiatrist's attention in the new ASICS shoe drop. Like, follow and share for some more content from your pride podiatrists.